Northern Youth claims that Nigeria has lost $1 billion in revenue during the first quarter of 2023 due to crude oil thefts. Secretary Coalition of Northern Youth Mukhtar Adamu charges the government to initiate steps to end crude oil theft in the country and also quest for improved revenue to tackle the migrant of economic challenges that Nigeria losses millions of barrels of crude oil in a year because of theft and vandalism. Speaking at the press conference on applauding NNPC crude oil and natural resources security and Tompolo's patriotic intervention in Abuja, moreover, Mukhtar Adamu said that NNPC has indeed acted well in encouraging local content development in the oil and gas industry concerning the case of Tompolo. However, the Northern Youth commends the laudable leadership of the Minister of State in Petroleum Sector and also the managing director of the NNPC for taking the bull by the horns in this critical period in the country. It must be stated that the NNPC is not dealing with government. Pemupolo as an individual, but rather with a private company, he has an interest in which, in our opinion, is not an aberration, but a step in the right direction. Nigerians must realize that oil theft has drastically reduced our production capacity, thereby affecting all revenue accrued to the country. The development has led to a drop in the government's earnings, creating environmental pollution and other health hazards. It is also a fact that Nigeria loses mil millions of barrels of crude oil a year because of theft and vandalism including the tapping of crude oil from a maze of pipeline owned by major oils, underscoring how poor security causes vast financial losses for the country. It is the statement of the fact that there is no better time than now for government to initiate steps to stop crude oil theft in the country in our quest for improved revenue to tackle the myriad of economic challenges in the country. The Coalition of Northern Youth commends the Honorable Minister of State for Petroleum and the leadership of the NMPC for this laudable initiative that would go a long way in improving the crude oil revenue for the country. The fact that due process was followed in the contract process is also a display of unalloyed commitment by the Honorable Minister of State for Petroleum entrenched a regime of transparency and accountability in Nigeria's critical oil and gas sector. The Coalition of Northern Youth states unequivocally that the award of the contract to Mr. Tompolo's firm is a step in the right direction and must be applauded by all Nigerians. The strategic importance of the move to halt crude oil theft in the country cannot be overemphasized. It remains a step in the right direction and must be supported by Nigerians to succeed. Atonda Babatunde, GTV Africa.